What's going on, y'all? Five Sports Talk back at it with another video talking some NFL, talking more NFL free agent signings. And the latest one has Eddie Lacy, yes, the former Packers running back, signing with the Seattle Seahawks. So Eddie Lacy agreed to terms on a new deal with the Seattle Seahawks for about one year and $5.5 million with just about $3 million guaranteed. So was this a good signing or bad signing? Well, I'm going to say it was a decent signing. I don't think I want to lean too heavy one way or another. Now, clearly the Seahawks running game has been an issue ever since Marshawn left. I mean, Thomas Rawls emerged on the scene and had a great rookie year, but he was plagued with injuries last year. CJ Procise looked good, but then he was plagued with injury as well. Um, and so they really haven't found consistency and stability at that position since Marshawn Lynch, since Beast Mode. Now, am I saying Eddie Lacy is the answer? No, I don't think he is, but I do think Eddie Lacy is going to add um, some healthy competition to this backfield. And I think Eddie Lacy is the most talented of the three backs at his best. I mean, people tend to forget just how good Eddie Lacy used to be before, you know, he quote unquote gained weight and just, you know, let himself go. And he does play um, at a higher weight than most RBs, and that's really been the reason last year. He was still averaging around five yards a carry before he had that ankle injury and then he was placed on IR. So Eddie Lacy is still a good and viable running back, but you know, the playing weight and, and keeping that under control has really been to his detriment. So what do I think is going to happen? I think he's going to definitely get some starting reps with the Seahawks. I think they he will compete with Rawls and Procise, uh, obviously, but I think Procise is more of a receiving back I think he'll be the passing down back and then it'll be Rawls versus Lacey and I think Lacey is good enough to beat Rawls and you know what like I mentioned it's a one-year deal it's not a lot of investment it's a prove it type of deal and I think it's a smart contract for the Seahawks I think it's a smart signing uh this doesn't mean they can't bring in another running back but I think they should be good to go now uh there were reports about Adrian Peterson but you know that obviously didn't end up happening so I think for overall with the contract situation, with the money guaranteed, I think for the Seahawks, it's a great deal. Eddie Lacy uh, gets a chance to prove himself, and really, he's in a good situation on a good team with a good defense and a good quarterback, so he's not going to be uh, relied on a lot, and you shouldn't um, rely on Eddie Lacy that much. So with that being said, overall, I like the signing. I think it's pretty good, uh, and I think it's a great deal for the Seahawks. Um, so I think it has the opportunity to work out. And because they have depth, I like it even more. So that's just what I think. Let me know what you guys think about Eddie Lacy signing with the Seattle Seahawks. Leave a comment down below. And as always, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.